Hello, aloha, shalom, guten tag, salut, chin dobri, howdy, bonjour, and uh, any other languages that I've missed out that I don't really know. New Bodhi came in a nice bag, very fancy, and it's from EF Archery, and it's a Turkish style horse bow. It's really nice. Weighs nothing, absolutely nothing. I'm shocked at how lightweight it is. It's ash with bamboo and then a clear glass on top of it. Leather grip. Nice wee sort of string pads there. Uh, the reason I got it was partly the price was really good. It's well made, well finished. Everything's real nice quality about it. Uh, but, as opposed to my wee Ali bow, Turkish bow, this one draws to in theory 32 inch. Now I haven't shot it, but I've drawn it a couple of times and it's a real beast when it gets past 100, uh, 100 when it gets past 31 inch, it's really really heavy to draw. So, I've brought bow scales, let's see how easy it is to string it up, and we'll weigh it. I've got a marked arrow as well. So the way I do it is I step through Now I'm clumsy so and I'm wearing big dark boots. So like that and I just hook it back like so. Oh, come on, there we go. Check it's in there to string pads. The brace height's about six and a half inches, so that's about right. I put a knock point on it this morning, which is possible. Well, it's actually it's moving, but we'll see how it goes. Right, just draw it a couple of times. Hang on, I put my glove on. <laughs> I brought this for Sigman to see. There's a normal glove. What I've done as I've cut two fingers off a normal glove because I couldn't get a thumb ring to fit me and I haven't got the money to go and order a load and I just do it like that and I put it on my thumb and then I just wrap that around my skinny wee wrist and it works pretty well it gives me all the protection I need I can shoot bare thumb but I've no shot for a month now so Forget the fact that my shooting will be dead at dreadful, but let's have a look at it being drawn. Just warm up a wee tiny bit, since I've not used it before. So it's 30 at 28 and it draws to 32 inch, so it should be about 35 I'd have thought, 34 maybe, at full draw. There you go. That's drawn a mile. There's about 28 there, because my draw is 29, so, but we'll find out with my marked arrow. <laughs> like all boy, good boy scouts, I've come prepared. So this arrow is 32 inch from the throat of the knock to the tip. The end of that first black electrician's tape is 28. 29, 30, 31, 32. So let's just see how far it does draw first. So I'll move back a bit. So there's 28, 29. Do it properly, Stuart, don't do it at all. 28, 29. 30, 31, 32, so 32, it suddenly stacks at about 31, to there it's super smooth, past there it gets heavy, it will do it but it gets heavy, so using my wee bow scale thing, which is probably a luggage scale but hey who cares, and we'll measure the draw weight, so it's set at pounds, and it's set to 
zero. Never mind, best laid plan. Right, so I've zeroed that. Twenty eight. It's showing stuck in some way. Twenty nine point four. Thirty one. Thirty four pounds. So it goes up about two pounds for every inch, which is fine. That's what I was hoping for. I was hoping for 35 at full draw, so it's just about spot on. I've got a variety of arrows away me the day. I just made these up. They're 700 spine carbons from SF Archery. 80 grain points, 4 3 inch shield fletchings, and they're uncut, so they're 31 inch. I've got my 500 spine traditional hunter, 3 4 inch parabolics, and it's the one that's got the map length on it. I've got these arrows, which are not too heavy, which I ordered from the same company, AF Archery, and they've got 3 5 inch shield cut, nice wrap on them nice looking arrows i've got a dozen of them and i've got three random arrows with whistling points on them just for a bit of a laugh so let's find out how the bow shoots will we please allow for the fact that i haven't shot for a month And I'm shooting from about 10 yards. Thumb. Low and right. But very quick. I was expecting to be alone right before I get my eye in. That's me, it's not a bow. <laughs> this thing way past my nose. Much slower, it's a lot heavier arrow. The arrows that I got for it. The arrows that I made up for it. The SF 700 spines that I made for it. Flying really straight and really fast out the board, a few spot on. Let's try these wooden ones. Same place. Oh, got a whistling one. Much lower, heavier arrow again. Very heavy tip on the end of the whistler. First arrow has been near enough to the right height, so my brain's picking in. Second arrow is just a bit right. Oh, 
<laughs> Nothing to write home about. Mostly low and right. And I'm shooting from a wee bit to the left, so that's why some of them are looking. Oh, they're in straight enough. There we go. Not too bad for my first shots in a month. Right, I'll just get them out and we'll carry on. <laughs> 